Welcome to the Seedlink platform. Today I'm covering how to review varieties in a collaborative trial on our web platform. Please check out our previous videos, how to accept a collaborative trial through an invitation email before diving into this video. First off, I want to encourage you to check out the Seedlink apps on the Apple Store or Google Play. The apps allow you to use the platform on your smartphone or tablet while on the go. So let's get started on reviewing varieties in a collaborative trial. Log in to your Seedlink profile and go to the Track tab. Below are all the plantings that are part of your growing season on Seedlink. These are either collaborative trials in green or plantings that you've made yourself in white. On the left-hand tab, click on Plantings. You are welcome to search your plantings by crop type. Before we jump into reviewing, I'd like to encourage you to add a check variety to any collaborative trial that you are part of. To learn more about what a check variety is and why you should add one to a trial, check out the link tutorial video on how to add a check variety to a trial. All right, now let's go through reviewing varieties in a trial. Find a collaborative trial that you'd like to review and click on the blue review button. This is the page where you submit your reviews for this trial. Please note that you do not need to complete all your reviews at once. We encourage you to come back to the site throughout the season and review the traits applicable at that time. As you can see on my profile, this is a collaborative trial for beefsteak tomatoes that I am part of this year. If you add a check variety to a trial, it will be marked here. Let's go through the different areas you can enter reviews. Dates button. These help you track dates associated with your trial. Helpful dates to track include planting date, transplant date if applicable, first harvest date, and last harvest date. These dates help us determine the days to maturity for each variety in your growing zone. If any dates are the same for all varieties in a trial, select the apply to all varieties in this planting to speed up the entry process. Photos button. Next to the date button is a photos button. Here you can upload as many photos of each variety as you would like as you visually catalog your plants throughout the season. Comments button. You can add open comments for each variety throughout the season in this area. Report failure button. If a particular variety dies before you're able to fully review it, you can remove the variety with this button. Traits. These are the traits that were selected by the trial manager for you to evaluate for this collaborative trial. For each variety, click on the Rate button under the trait that you are evaluating. A pop-up comes up. Feel free to add a comment to your rating. You are welcome to rate a given trait more than once during a season. An example of this would be rating disease resistance at first fruit harvest and adding a second rating for disease resistance at last harvest. Additionally, you can edit or delete ratings with these buttons if you make a mistake. Your progress. At the bottom of the page, you can track your progress of reviewing this trial with the progress wheel. Participant map. This is where you can view where other trial participants are located. Once your progress wheel is at 90 to 95% and all that's left is complete trial, you're ready to complete your trial and submit your reviews. Click on the complete my reviews button at the top of the page. Before your results are submitted, we'd like you to share a summary of your thoughts on each variety in the trial. Let us know if you'd grow each variety again, share final variety comments, and add a smiley for each. Then click continue. Last, we appreciate feedback on the growing conditions your trial was exposed to. Let us know if your grow out of the varieties was successful or not, conventional or organic, along with the location, management, soil, light exposure, climate, and stress. Finally, share any overall management comments for the planting. Once filled in, select Complete Trial and you're done reviewing the varieties for this collaborative trial. Congratulations! A completed collaborative trial will now move from the Plantings tab into the Results tab. You can now view the current aggregated results for the trial by finding the Trial and Results tab and clicking on the Results button for the trial. On this page, you can filter the results by trait, roles, hardiness zone, and varieties. Also, you can see the results of Would You Grow This Again survey, as well as look at other participants' variety photos and comments. If you accidentally completed a trial before you entered all your reviews, you can go back to the results tab, find your trial, and click on the gear to the right of the trial. Select Edit Your Reviews. 
This will send the trial back to the Plantings tab and you can continue editing your reviews to the trial. Once you are done adding your reviews, go back through the process of completing the trial as previously outlined. So that is how you review varieties in a collaborative trial on our web platform. Every rating you add to the SeedLink platform powers our Seed Explorer and helps our collective growing community find the right seed. Thank you for participating. If you are having any problems with your profile, please reach out to us at help at seedlink.com. If you have any feedback on how to make the platform better, share your ideas with us at feedback at seedlink.com.